Hi guys and welcome to student database management system developed in Python using MySQL. Right, let me show you guys how the whole system works. I'm going to take you straight to this very tab. In this tab, as you guys can see, the details of Charlie is not recorded here. However, all the unit taken by Charlie, they are all recorded in there. So if I click on add, those details should appear here. But let me show you guys the database first. On the database, as you can see as well, details of Charlie is not on the system. So now, let's minimize that and click on add. Once again, looking at Charlie's details is not there. So now click on add. There we go, successfully added. Click on OK. And if we go back in here now, we should be able to support Charlie's details right away. And if we go back to our database in here, Charlie's details is not showing, but you will have to refresh it. And there, yeah, that's Charlie right there. Now, let's exit out. No, we're not going to exit out. Okay, we can delete if we want. But we're not going to delete that let's reset there we go now this is the most important part if i select any of these and click on result there we go you see the date selected is officially shown in there so select any date there we go let's reset that and add some other candidate details but before that, if we go back to the tab here, take a good look at that. Whatever subject that we select in here is officially added straight onto the table. You see that? That is a core unit. And if we repeat the same thing for some other unit, enter value in there. and go back right there and there they are okay so we're going to add a new student details in there I just want to show you guys how this part of it works and we add some other student details all right that is taken care of and if you come in here every single subject selected they are all populated in here so click on the table now let's enter the student details and the name let's say the name is Peter Johnson address number 43 wallet way and a postcode it's mail and there we have the details of Peter and the nest of King now right here what department and um, what is he studying is into serious games and peter happens to be an international student so we're going to leave that as nothing and here we enter yes for overseas accommodation yes is he on exchange program yeah he is on exchange program in that case the scholarship and what is he studying he's studying bsc in something so in here it's going to be b bachelor of science so let's say he happens to be in his second year so what we then need to do is click on result there we go there second class upper and let's have a look at the students details there as you can see his details are not on the system itself so if we go back in here let's look at peter peter johnson and let's click on add new but before that let's go straight to the database his details and all uh, his details are not on the database as well so let's minimize that and just click on add new there we go that's successful there and let's go into the student details now and let's look for peter johnson right there that is peter johnson's detail right there in the system now and for information guys this is just an overview the full tutorial will be made available shortly 
and please do subscribe to this channel and i'm going to just use this opportunity to say thank you to my subscribers and i'm going to shout out to the following people reggie smith victor thank you for being a channel member camilla beta and all of you this is thanks for being a channel member guys and just for your information like i said this is an overview bye for now